The Kremlin is now reacting, says it doesn't know anything about this 2016 meeting between Donald Trump's son and a Russian lawyer. In fact, the Kremlin says they don't know who the lawyer is at all, really. Seen as Matthew Chance, live in Moscow with more. Matthew. John and Poppy, hi. Uh, that's right. The Kremlin are trying to put as much distance as they can between these renewed allegations of collusion on the part of Russian surrogates uh, and the Trump candidates, uh, Trump candidates and the Trump team, uh, saying they had no idea who this uh, this Russian lawyer was. Her name is uh, Natalia Veselnitskaya. Um, she's represented government uh, businesses in the past. She's also got strong links uh, with um, uh, with government officials in this country, or at least uh, government appointees uh, in this country. Um, and she's also been prominent in um, trying to do two things. First of all, overturn the ban on U.S. adoptions of Russian children. And secondly, trying to repeal the Magnitsky Act. And I think that may have been uh, some of the well, some of the questions we need to ask is that was she going to meet the Trump candidate team uh, to advocate the lifting of the Magnitsky Act? We said the uh, uh, the, the meeting was about uh, adoptions and, and, and the ban on that. But that was a Russian measure that was imposed following the United States decision, the Obama administration decision, uh, to impose sanctions on government officials in Russia uh, for taking part uh, in the Magnitsky fraud, $230 million. It was identified as a tax fraud. The lawyer, Sergei Magnitsky, who identified it, was killed while he was in police custody, and the U.S. took legal, legal sanctions on those responsible. Um, as a result, she has been uh, Natalia Veselnitskaya has been a leading advocate in Russia to get that U.S. act of law lifted. And so I think the big question is, did she go to, 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 uh, to New York, to Trump Tower, to advocate a new Trump administration, potentially, if it were elected, to do just that?